those in favor that the Human Sexual Rights and Family Values Bill 2021 be taken through the third ring. Say aye. aye. Those against, say no. Honorable members, the eyes have it. The Human Sexual Rights and Family Values Bill 2021 is read the third time and passed. An act, an act to provide for human sexual rights and family values and related matters. Simple like that. These are not my own words. These words are coming from the parliament. <laughs> Welcome lovely people, our sex is here once again and welcome to Rich Men's Media where we give you quality content and entertainment news. Now before I proceed now, I have a question for Mahama. Mahama, Ghana passes bill making identifying as LGBTQ plus illegal. What do you have to say about this Mr. President? Me, me duty in my faith is against LGBTQ. Me assemblies of God. Me. <laughs> if we say the faith I have Empany say Bema Bewari Bema or Ba Bewari Oba. And so me personally Benjin this and I I a man is a man, a woman is a woman. Me believe it say nipa uti me a sorry I can say um me feel you or me muse me or bar. And so yeah woman bear my intimate cause a sa no my your ba they be I mean nature created as man and woman. And Nyame Boyano, he knew what he was doing when he created us like that. And so if you ask me, my personal faith is against it. Yes, now when you see Mahama Jin today, let's just say, Oshima, and your parliament to form one among person who be LGBTQ in the tomb. They say almost a sexual human rights or a human sexual rights act and family value act, which means they are trying to protect their family. Preach, preach. And it's how you LGBTQ, I fash out them. If you come out and you identify yourself as an LGBTQ who come life this no life no, not, not life imprisonment you are going in for three yes. years and if you be like oh me I don't do LGBTQ but I support them I will sponsor them I will promote them because my brand because of my brand or because of that 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 you too who cry there you 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 past the the, the the LGBTQ you are going in for five good years let me read this article for you. Ghana's parliament has passed a tough bill that imposes a prison sentence to up to three years for anyone convinced of identifying as LGBTQ+. It also imposes a maximum five-year jail term for forming or funding LGBTQ groups. Yes, sir. Preach, preacher! Pasha, when you seek a business, Papa, not this type of business. Otherwise, five years. Lawmakers heckled down attempt to replace prison sentence with community service and counseling. It is the latest sign of growing opposition to LGBTQ plus rights in the conservative West African nation. Bro, Uganda for pass or more a lot of African countries and they are going to pass this bill. Please, if you dare for US, I dare your lane. Preach, preacher! But you'll be any lame. I don't understand, sir. This country, some people are saying, sir, oh, as a result of that, you know, it's gonna hinder a lot of people from coming to, you know, Ghana as a tourism. <laughs> Bro, if you go to Dubai, they don't accept LGBTQ, but it be where a lot of people they go there. Just go and have fun. But if you go there, don't pose, don't identify yourself as anything. Be a human being and do anything. It's not in Dubai where you are going to raise the um, rainbow flag or you are going to, you know you know advertise your 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 sexual a lot of people are straight but they don't come outside to be like oh we are straight raising flags straight flags da 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 da, da. so if you go to dubai you do, just go as a normal person normal human being do your thing it's not even only lgbtq you can't even kiss people outside like making love these things are supposed to happen behind the scenes what you say so this is not going to prevent people from coming and also going to hinder the tourism and how one attract Work as normal human being. When you enter a room, you do your nakpa nakpa and you go home. Everyone is at peace. That is what Ghana is asking for. If you have watched this video till this far, please don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share. Just like this video so that the next person will get the opportunity to watch it. Yes.
those in favor that the Human Sexual Rights and Family Values Bill 2021 be taken through the third ring. Say aye. aye. Those against, say no. Honorable members, the eyes have it. Now we and a man for some people are talking about it. As a guy, a friend, the DODA, he says the bill is one of my legislation and law is made, and these are rubbish. <laughs> these are rubbish. A lot of people are also using this as an opportunity to jackpot, to travel away, to run away from the country. Because some people are saying, sir, uh, based on Uganda accepting, sir, you cannot be LGBTQ. It has affected the tourism and one white act. So if also Ghana accept the LGBTQ, it is also going to affect Ghana. That one, they don't know. Me, if you ask me if I support or I don't support, please, I am a Christian. I would, I, I don't support it. But I don't really have issue with someone who is doing it. Preach, preacher! Before I'm on for the hey, oh yeah, oh yeah, Auntie, wah, 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 wah. She said, and sunny flowers will be there, will be there, or my boom. You can't. So yeah, this is what is going on in Ghana. BBC granted an interview, and if you check the interview properly, you can see that, hmm, some people are using this opportunity to travel, to run away. Because you staying in Ghana, no crown, Ghana is not for you already. So when you say LGBTQ, I'm a person now, you are coming to say, say, oh, as a result of, you know, Ghana is doing that, you know, I can't even go out and even my neighbor can, you know, snitch. Yeah, Ghanaians, they are, Ghanaians, they, are, they can snitch, especially LGBTQ, they will snitch. Even me, I will snitch. This man! Even me, I will snitch. Imagine if you are living in the same compound and you are doing this and we have kids and they are learning from you, who will not snitch? Yes, sir! So yeah, that one, the one he said, um, and my neighbors was snitch, and I agree. He's, uh, he also said that he was fired from his workplace for being gay. I'm so scared, very, very scared, and I don't know my fate. My life is at stake. It will be my end in Accra. Life was a bit better before this whole bill started. I lost my job because I was gay. My previous workplace, my madam had to sack me. She spoke to me and she was like, I should change from my ways. And then I was like, no. And she kept on coming back with the Bible, Bible. She also can't accept a gay person as a worker. I feel like relocating from the country itself to any LGBT country, which is safe for me to live in. For me personally, I've been attacked so many times by my family. After they got to know about my sexuality, yes, I had to leave them for a while. Tourism revenue is very big for Ghana. As we've seen with what happened in Uganda after the bill became law, tourists were not choosing Uganda as the preferred destination, and this is going to be a huge hit uh, to Ghana. I have to like count my steps, make sure I don't offend anyone. I have to live like a refugee in my own country. Are you worried that somebody will report you to the police? Very worried. I'm very, very worried about that. Anyone can snitch. Even in my, my current neighborhood, anyone can do that to me. So if you watch the video, you could hear that someone was saying that, oh, um, because I was gay, I was being fired or I was sacked from my workplace. Yes, because probably your moral ground was colliding with the owner's moral ground or the, the owner of the company's moral ground because I can't hire you if you are, you know, posing some risks to, to, to my religious value or my belief or something like that. Yeah, it'd be only UK here where people will agree. But in Ghana, the Africa, they, they, take, they are too religious to the extent that even if you talk against their religious, the way they will look at you, you know, and I say, even if you are making facts, they don't care because they choose, they, 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 have, they have chosen to believe that. So if you are coming to work for me and you are going to post yourself as a gay or like as, as a lesbian and you are going to, you know, make me feel some type of way, you go home. Yes, sir. What do I say? So yeah, Ghana, you know, people are talking about it. A lot of people, some people are 
He said, hallelujah. Some people are saying hooray. A lot of people are saying that the USA and the, you know, the, 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 the developed countries should come for them. Otherwise, they can't stay in Accra. They can't live in Accra. People will snitch. But me, I don't have problems. But if the USA and the, you know, the, the, the European countries don't take and they're going to be like, oh, we are going to build an asylum for LGBTQ family who are not, you know, allowed to live freely, they are not freely to live comfortably in their own country because they are identifying themselves as an uh, as LGBTQ. So we are going to, you know, allow them to travel into our country. Sir. I give them two months. Everyone will become LGBTQ. Everyone will change. Everyone will change their identity. Hello. This man. <laughs> no, no, don't lie that. You know what I'm saying? No. no. Oh. God have mercy upon us. I'm saying it again. If United States of America, UK, Australia, all the, all the Western world, all the developed countries, if they pass a, they, they also pass a bill that if you are in Ghana or you are in Africa and they are not allowing you to live freely by identifying yourself as an LGBTQ member, you, you have a free visa to travel into our countries. I give them two months. I, those who don't have passport to do their passport. Those who don't have... Bro! Allah. Ghana, how many, how many will be? 30 million. Our population. I give them two years. Over 10 million of Ghana population will travel to abroad. They will identify themselves as, uh, as an LGBT I know this guy. This guy will do the same. You know, Mr. Snitch. I know this snitch. I know this snitch. I know this guy will jackpot from Ghana. I know this so yeah this is what is going on and we are praying that you know if you are an lgbtq do it in your room don't come out because if you come out and you identify yourself as one they call. so yeah ladies and gentlemen this is what i've got for you if you are an lgbtq just be careful because people are going to snitch on you peace i'm signing out mm.